Intro Hello everyone, welcome to this YouTube video. Today, we will be exploring a fun and exciting project that was built by ChatGPT using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. We will be looking at a dinosaur game that was built entirely from scratch. This game is designed to be simple yet challenging. Let's dive right in and explore how this game was built. Setup Before we begin, let's quickly go over the setup. First, you will need a code editor like Visual Studio Code, and you will also need a web browser like Google Chrome. Once you have those things set up, you can open up the code editor and begin coding. HTML Let's start with the HTML. The HTML for this game is relatively simple. It consists of a div container that contains two other divs. One of these divs is the dinosaur, and the other is the ground. The dinosaur div has a class of dino, and the ground div has a class of ground. CSS Next, let's move on to the CSS. The CSS is responsible for styling the game. The dinosaur div is styled with a height and width of 50px and a background color of black. The ground div has a height of 25px and a width of 100%, and it is colored green. JavaScript Now let's move on to the JavaScript. The JavaScript is where all the magic happens. The game is built using the canvas element, which is an HTML element that allows for dynamic, scriptable rendering of 2D shapes and bitmap images. The game starts by setting up the canvas element and getting a reference to its context. The game loop is then started, which is responsible for updating the game state and rendering the game. The game loop uses request animation frame to render the game at 60 frames per second. In each frame, the game state is updated, and the game is rendered. The game state includes the position of the dinosaur and the position of the cacti. The cacti are randomly generated and move across the screen from right to left. If the dinosaur collides with a cactus, the game is over. The game also includes a score counter that keeps track of how many cacti the player has successfully avoided. The game ends when the player collides with a cactus, and their score is displayed. And there you have it, a fully functional dinosaur game built by ChatGPT using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. This game is simple yet challenging and provides hours of fun for anyone who plays it. If you want to try out this game for yourself, be sure to check out the code in the description below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. If you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe this YouTube channel. For more videos stay tuned.